Fantasy Sports College Football presents in cooperation with the CFA, the Florida State Seminoles, and the Florida Gators. And here, and we're ready to play a big one. And here comes Green for the Gators getting a block on the corner and finding a track that gets him all the way upstairs down. Here we go with it. Little quick pop to the left side over to Hilliard. Hilliard finds room. Bumbles the football and the Seminoles recover it. And from the 36, Cadell throws same kind of a play. And it's swung out to a running back, Warwick Dunn. Get it here, and he's caught 39 passes. Quickly to the attack on second down and 10. The ball is thrown to un No pretensions at running here. Out of the shotgun, air ball, they call it. The ball is batted down at the line. You've got to do something quickly because the Gators are coming. The pass is away. It's over the head. Uh, third and 10. Pitch it out to Dunn. Gets a little help from the tiny. His longest field goal this season, 34. This one is from 40. There's plenty of leg on it. And it's good. Here's a high hanging kick now. And this is Green. He's one of the special team stars for the Gators. And he is rolled out at one first down from the 21 yard line. Werfel looks and throws quickly in the patent for the first down for the Gators. And Werfel turns, gives to the running back. Voila! We have a running play as Elijah Williams. The crowd gets quiet when the Gators have the ball. And Danny Werfel back looks down the middle, goes short instead. He had Doring down the middle. And he gets around. And indefatigable. Down the middle this time with the pass. It is caught by second down and five. Pressure coming. Down he goes. Werfel getting pressure from the backside. Caught again in the backfield. Three wide outs. And it on the play coming around. The jump. Second down and six as Danny Werfel gets protection. Throws a little bit. It is third and six. Pressure coming. Gets away. He's got a first down. Danny Werfel runs. Just inside the 42, he hands the ball away to Jackson. And Perry Jackson goes from power running. Six minutes and ten seconds remaining in the first quarter. Florida State leading 3 0. Gators are threatening. Got a man in the end zone. Touchdown. Jack Green. Here he comes again. And he's back to throw. And he loops his pass. His second birth, though. Wolfram back on second down and 10. Gets his pass away as it is. It's still about 10. Pressure up the middle. And uh, Sam Dunn is the deep man. Dunn skipping into the middle of the line. We'll take it down and four. Joe Blitz. All given off. Dunn. Dunn is decked. One of them is done. Gets some pressure, passes away into the end zone, and it is incomplete. It Travis Chambers puts it down. It's got enough leg on it, and it's good. Ball is at the 27-yard line. Wurzel is back, and he's looking around, lets it go, and he's got his man. Nice down and ten. Seminoles may have been in the neutral zone. Here's a big play for Terry. Before he started playing on Sunday. Werfel back, loops it to the sideline. The ball is caught by Anthony. Riddell Anthony in the second quarter. Werfel back, looking around, lets it go underneath. Ball is caught. Going again. Down the middle, Goring for the one. Jackson's got the ball. Walks in. Touchdown.
That is difficult for them. This ball is thrown to number 89. They've got 10 seconds to get it off. And they go. They're lined up in there in a slot. There's a potential receiver, and he's open. He throws it to him. But he went out there and wasted the guy covering him. Second down and 10. That pass is thrown underneath the coverage. Up the freshman out of Spring Hill. On third down and three. Short of the 20. Danny back looking around. Goes into the end zone for Gurley. Touchdown. That will be a pass. Nope. nope. Elijah Williams. Williams. Handed away on the right. Over back. Goes underneath. Now, first down at the gate of 49 yard line. They got a problem, and part of the problem has to. That's wrong to Cooper and Andre Big. No, they're not. They're not, not for Florida State. Canal is sacked to the top, I want to tell you. This pass is flipped out to Ike Hilliard. Here's Wolf looking around, looking around. Here's the difference. Change the play here. I'll give it to Elijah. No, Up the middle. Could drive a truck down and 18 or so, at least. That ball is thrown down the middle. I mean, just Seminole side of the field. Junkhead Green trying to get around. Not miss a day of practice thanks to this man. He Suspiciously, huh? <laughs> oh, look at this. Well, you here in the stadium right now with a record crowd on him because the Gators have the ball. He cannot deliver because he holds the ball a little longer and has been throwing it deep. Warwick Dunn, heading outside, slips him and gets the first down. That does not go to tackle him. Canal goes to the sidelines, completely. Second down and 10, Cannell has a man wide open and hits him. Cooper, same socks each week, shoes. Cannell looking around and throws. Done. There he goes. There he goes. Tough. Rock Preston gives him a breather. Has the ball going right up the middle. It fell. Can't play it anymore. Come. Bad knee. Goes to Preston. He's inside the five. At the Gator three. It's done. He's in there. Touchdown for the Seminoles. Comes in motion, becoming a receiver, and Cannell back to throw. Done. Good. Right here. I think you're going to see him open it up again. Orko comes out on first down. Let's it go down the middle for Hilliard. There's your answer. Touchdown. The 19 now for the nose as Cannell rolls up. Gets his pass off, and he's got a man out there, and he caught the ball at the 46 now as the nose try to come back with another one. This is done. First man looked like he might have had. He got only two because he hit the truck. Here goes Dunn the other way. Look at that on first down, Canero wants to go big. He's got Cooper. And in love with these guys. Black Preston in the backfield. Gets a block. For his foot. Down the middle. Tonight. Warwick Dunn and Pooh Bear Williams in the backfield. Pooh Bear is in front. Shotgun for Cannell. Nobody. Nobody. Now he throws it in the back of the end zone. 21 points. Well, it is not a fake, as you might have suspected or have been suspected. 
This time he runs it. Goes. Danny's got all day. Same play. It's being dinged up. And the late goal. That ball goes through the hands of Stevenson and the Seminole Flattery. They work out of the shotgun. Pennell. Looking around. He's got Cooper. Touchdown. Pennell's warming up. Just like last year. tailback is out. Uh, they've had injuries at that position all year. This is just back to Danny Work. Pressure comes, steps away from him, loops the pass out. Good to Evan. He's wide open. Big play. And the big old fool down there on the full head of steam and Sean Hamlin said, I need some help. Pass to the corner for Doreen. Oh. Second down and ten. Danny looking at him again. He's got it right to his right. Werfel going the other way. See what's over there, and... Oh! Work. And Cannell back. Slam! It started up. It just started up. Cannell's pass has got a man over there. That's Cooper. And he's using the field judge. He's usually in the middle of the field. This is done. Just pass away and it's complete. So it's first down at the 41 yard line. And Warwick Dunn. Receivers. Going deep for Cooper. Intercepted on the ricochet by Anton Lott. And coming back. Game, it's just incredible. Florida, first down on the. Flicks it up the field. Five minutes at 457. Werfel looking around is hit from behind. The ball in field position. Canell's pass quickly to Preston. Canell down the middle too high. Intercepted by Mike Harris. Florida State 43. This is Terry Jackson. Florida trying to burn the clock. Give it to Jackson. And he's close. Four, three, takes it on two. Gives it to Terry Jackson, and he's stuck down. Right down to two or three seconds. No, he snapped a little earlier. And spread out from sideline to sideline as Werfel runs a quarterback draw. And 108 to play. And Werfel going for the bundle. Incomplete. Nebraska and Florida, if they get by next week, Arkansas. That's an it. Chuck Rowe just fainted over here, <laughs> the executive director of the Citrus Bowl, the Florida Citrus. Right. They came from nowhere. Here's the third down and short. And the forward progress looks like it might very well be a first down. But what we're doing now is just simply running out the clock. This ball game is in the bank for the Florida Gators. They have a lead of 35 to 24 and uh, the clock is running. Well, we, we said John Cooper had a great year and in Ohio State. What about these Florida Gators and Steve Spurrier? Well, they were expected to be a, a good football team and they have been a good football mm -hmm. team. They have a lot of talent around here. Intercepted on the ricochet, and the game is over. So you might as well just go ahead and sit down, son. The party is all in Gainesville as the Gators have defeated about that new. <laughs> Your final score is 35 24.